Good morning, brother. No news, I'm afraid. But I have a plan. Do you now? The Nords. You found them once. Could you do so again? I could try, but... I don't see how that they would help... They are the fates of these lands, are they not? I would know what they know. You may not find them cooperative. As long as I find them, where do we search? Midgard. But if Atreus is in Asgard, there's no getting him back without an army. We should be raising one. Yes, nothing like a catastrophic war to improve the situation. The boy seems quite capable, perhaps if you simply give him some time. You are not free of blame here. You encouraged his foolishness, his confusion. I do not seek war. But if Odin has stolen my son, do not doubt the lengths I will go to. Your nature has always been clear, Kratos. But you, Freya. War is a first resort. That's not the Freya I knew. I hope the Norns can give you the counsel you need. Perhaps mine is no longer of use here. Oh. Tear, stop. This is no time to divide ourselves further. Come, sit, please. You have been quiet. Frankly, I'm surprised you of all people would seek out fate. But your instincts haven't let us down so far. Let's find the norms. Who am I to offer him counsel? I only hoped to help the boy find his answers. And I failed. What's my role in all this now? Tyr, you're at the center of this. You always have been. That's why Odin imprisoned you in the first place. He's terrified of you. I doubt that very much. It's the truth. And not just because of prophecies. No one has ever united the realms as you once did. That is not who I am anymore. I know you feel that way now. I've lost myself before, more than once, but believe me, there is something beyond that. And what is that? Purpose. Purpose is the path that leads you to yourself. So you would have me accept my fate. Lead your armies into war, secure your vengeance. If securing our justice is not your purpose, then find another, for your own sake.
Hang on! I got something for you. Sindri! Coming! Before you go traipsing off into the dawn, I thought you'd like to have this back. Hmm. Well, don't go getting too cheery about it. But you're welcome. I've collected what we need to find the Norns. Shall we go? I suspect we may have consequences to look forward to. We are certain the trace could not still be in Midgard. I was just there and found no trace. If Odin invited him, he must have provided a way. No. That is not the only explanation. Tell me where we find these Norns. I discovered some of their threads near the frozen lake. I stashed one for spellcrafting, but we may also use it to find them. Just remember, they really don't want to be found. Well, at least things will be difficult for a change. We should take your sled and head to the lake. Midgard. I miss the freezing gusts and constant raider attacks. Well, that's because they believe Kratos is responsible for Fimble Winter, and that killing him will end it. Where would they get an idea like that? From me, of course. Come. Of course. Quiet. She is a friend. No. Better they get this from you. Once the wolves have the scent of the Norns, we'll just need to follow their lead. Mm. I will open the gate. <laughs> Stop. Stop whining. Their fur is matted. When did you last brush them? They are wolves. And matted <laughs> fur leads to disease. Take care of them, and they'll take care of you. Brother, what exactly do you intend to ask the Norns? How I may find my son. Nothing more. I don't imagine it's a chance to clear up all this mess about prophecy. Perhaps get a second opinion on your alleged demise. You didn't tell me you had a death prophecy? When Atreus and I reached Jotunheim, we found a hidden mural. The giants. They herself. Had foreseen our entire journey long ago. Who we would meet. Who we would fight. All of it. As it happened. But you aren't dead. That image was from a time yet to come. I see. You've never struck me as someone who fears death. That's not the problem, is it? No. Death can have me when it earns me. Then maybe it's not the future that bothers you. Faye sent you on your journey, and she made sure you'd see that image at the end of it. And you're still not sure why. I wish to speak of this no further. Now that we are on the lake, how will we find the Norns? Watch the wolves closely. See how their heads point the way? Well, the Lake of Nine has certainly seen better days. Raiders have made themselves quite at home. Not sure I've been back to these parts since our great battle with Seekrin. She speaks highly of that fight as well. You know of that. She told me all about it when she found me. She believed you could be an ally. Long before I believed. The Valkyrie Queen. An ally. I'm the Valkyrie Queen. As Sigrun was stubbornly determined to remind me. I should have guessed it was Sigrun helping you recover yourself. She's so loyal. Why? Clever. Oh. Mm-hmm. Doesn't take a love goddess to see where you're coming from. Quiet. 
just hope the norms are somewhere indoors and warm. Safe to say, no, I have not missed Midgard in Thimblewinter. Thank you. <laughs> we will see soon enough. <laughs> Incoming fire! <laughs> Brother, I know that sword hilt. Tread carefully. You of all people know how weapons can carry ghosts. If it does not help us find the Norns, it can wait. Let's keep looking. This way. I feel a trace of their illusions here. I can try to dispel it. There's no time to wander off, brother. Freya's found something. Oh, no. There's nothing here. Uh, a false trail. I'm afraid so. We'll have to see what else the wolves can find. Typical Nornish mischief. They know we're searching. I warned you they wouldn't make it easy. And what's the hilt of a cursed king have to do with any of it? Distraction? Coincidence? Who knows? I suppose they'd say we were fated to find it. Mm. of fate we are tracing it's not somebody's life if that's what you mean the norns use it to mark their way when they're outside of the well the norns live in a well no the well of earth their home is hard to explain it's in no fixed place entrances come and go a place wholly under their influence where the intangible becomes tangible like being inside your own mind. But if we go in together, are we in each other's mind? Not so sure I like the sound of that. Kratos, 
A raider encampment. Shall we take care of them, brother? Mimir, have you encountered these norms? Not personally. Ray is right. They have ways of discouraging visitation. Odin made his share of efforts. Couldn't talk about what he found. Either he gave up, or he wanted to forget what he saw. There. You mind telling us what you experienced when you sought the norms last time? To be honest, the details are hazy. Like waking up from a dream. Mainly, I remember that nothing could be done to change my son's fate. Which only made me more determined to try. Brother, what of your story? You faced the fates of your homeland, yeah? Enough. We will continue Let's later. See. I feel something. In this direction. Feel what, exactly? Another illusion. It's coming from this wall. The Norns are hiding something. Kratos, I feel the Norns over here. Are you ready? Oh, no. Nothing. Another dead end. A trap! You know, this search will only get more dangerous. Then we keep looking. Back to the wolves, then. <laughs> the wolves have picked up another trail. <laughs> keep following their heads. Now, brother. What about when you faced the fates of Greece? The legends I heard about the ghost of Sparta were surely exaggerated. Exaggerated? Oh, not in the brazen bloodshed righteous fury part. The part where it said you traveled back in time itself to win a battle once lost. It strains credulity, obviously. I mean, a rumor about Thor knocking the world serpent back in history from Ragnarok is one thing. Here's the truth. The threads of fate span all life and time. The sisters of fate abused their power. When I challenged them, they threatened to undo my existence. So I killed them and turned their power on Zeus. That's the most dangerous and irresponsible thing I've ever heard. These Norns have no such magic. Nor does anyone in these realms that I've ever seen. Brother, seems the wolves have led us here. We need to work our way up. 
This way. through the ice? Oh, are the Norns making magical ice walls now? No. I think the water just froze. <laughs> <laughs> did to trick all these raiders into guarding them. Not that they have any idea that's what they're doing. Freya, thank you for your help. I know this was not your focus. The sooner we find your son, the sooner you'll be able to focus. I just hope it works. Just the same. Thank you. A fine sentiment, but write on a bloody note when we're out of the cold, brother. Seriously, whatever. Are you fucking serious, man? You're not ever gonna fight. Or not. in this fucking game. I don't. It just makes no sense at the time. Oh, 
stronger this time. Over here. <laughs> We found it. Ah, isn't it always the third place you look? <laughs> is everyone hearing that creepy whisper? It is like an itch in the mind. It means we've stepped into their domain. Be ready for anything. Illusions. Projections, possibly. But assume nothing. There's no telling what manner of creature they've made unwitting guards. Delightful. Okay, how? minds yet. He certainly seems real enough. I hate to tell you, the parts in your mind will be real too. Whatever. Just staying around fucking getting hit and dying inside every time. Going for me, I'm gonna ne Ok, 
Can I go over the tree? This place almost looks familiar, but different. Like a confused memory. A rather hostile memory at that. These fates should know I will not be deterred. <laughs> Certainly clinks like genuine hack silver. I suppose there's one small consolation to this ordeal. At least we won't have to introduce ourselves. Don't credit your reputation, Lemire. Hmm. They see the whole lives of any who approach them. What is that? <laughs> A phantom! Rogue magic! Aimed for the runic core! <laughs> What the fuck? Look at that thing! It's horrible when it glows! Let it glow! 
Oh my god, whatever. That was fucking awesome. Well, yet another gift of Thimble Winter, I suppose. The magic draining out of all of us has to end up somewhere. Oh. This way. The Norns are somewhere in that cave just ahead. She sound again. Normally, I don't mind ladies whispering in my ear, but this is positively awesome. Anyone ever tell you that you babble when you're terrified? <sighs> terrified? I'll have you know I'm at the very most deeply apprehensive. And breaking tension with humor is the sacred duty of a traveling companion. I, how very dare you! Babbling! To me, please. Stop! Why did you bring him here? You are not welcome here! Wait! Baldur, come back! Talk to me! Oh! <laughs> 
thinking I had any desire to be back on this itchy carcass. I'm quite serious, brother. Come and collect me. 